you know, and, and I think we had a question is how, how does the small guy benefit? And in my mind, the small guy benefits by using three PLs, four PLs to help them through this process because we already have that stuff done. We have the software in place. So with that, you're not covering that. What you're covering is more like warehouse charges rather than um, administrative salary type fees that you're going to get if you're running your own zone. You know, so maybe for the small guy that that has cash flow issues as he's starting off early, but he can pay the hundred dollar storage bill every month for his one pallet. You know, it might not be might be a good spot, so he doesn't have to pay the three thousand dollars in customs duty. So there are some advantages there that a smaller guy could take advantage of even if we're not looking at that six figure type savings um, to really dive into his own full force, you know, and, and for those smaller guys, as you grow, you know, there will become a tipping point where you say, well, maybe I want to do it myself and I want to house it in house. Um, but even then we have folks that utilize other parties to manage and run that foreign trade zone, even if it is their own private one, obviously that adds another layer of cost to it, but that is also an opportunity um, in inside of a foreign trade zone, so you as the importer don't specifically have to run that zone. Okay.